Hi everyone, Liz here, thanks for stopping by. So I've got an unpacking to do today and this one comes to me from diamondartgift.com um, There are a lot of special offers on that website at the moment. I know there's uh, buy three and get one free and there's all sorts of offers on postage and Christmas sales and all sorts going on. So rather than list them all, um, I'll see if I can take some screenshots. but uh, do go across to their uh, website, diamondartgift.com and check them out. So, a huge thank you to them for sending me this. And yeah, I've worked with them a couple of times before and I've loved the things that I've done. I've got some really nice Christmassy things from them. So, let's see what we got this time. Uh, I am joined again by the lovely Millie Moo. Say hello, Millie Moo. Is it Millie Moo? Hello. She's not speaking today, look, she's she's tired. Uh, we have snow today, so just pop you back uh, level, there you are. Yeah, we have snow today, so she's been out playing. I've had to defrost her several times, but she is okay now. <laughs> right, so we have, ooh, ooh, one parcel. And ooh, another parcel, ooh. And oh, oh, a special. Oh, and we've got a pen. Yay! Okay, you know, I like my novelties, so let's have a look at this one first. So, we've got a drill pen, and it's a key. Yay! Uh, my uh, daughter is moving into a new house uh, in the very near future, so I thought this, as she's a diamond painter, pick it out the packet would be quite nice as a new home gift. So, yeah, uh, they do several different colours in it, but I quite like the silver. Um, I thought it stood out a bit. We've got uh, just a little um, stamp there of what is that? KRD-315. Uh, I suppose that's just the key number or whatever. Um, we've got uh, a little hole there, so you could actually make it into a key ring. <laughs> a key is a key ring. Ba bam And then, yay, it's a diamond painting pen. So it's quite a nice uh, little nib there, just a single. So see if it'll just focus in. Come on, focus. It's having fun today. Wants to focus on my hands and not that, but never mind. But yeah, I think you can get the gist of that. So I thought that was quite a fun little product. And the price of that one is only 99 cents. So less than a dollar and uh, you're getting a nice little present. I thought it was just a bit of... Uh, what we call daft presents, you know, just to uh, pop into uh, her card. I don't think that comes off, does it? Does that screw out? Oh, that screws out. The oh, right. So, yeah, I mean, that does screw out. So you could quite possibly put a multiplacer in the other end as well. But I do quite like it as a key. Uh, I would think that the squishies will fit on it as well. They might be a bit slack. Let's have a look. Have we got a squishy near at hand? Oh, I do like having this bigger desk so I can just reach everything. Oh, yeah, they're about the same size as the... Um, oops, just get that on there. Yeah, they're about the same size as the pink pens. So you can use your cushion grips, your pen grips as well there, look. So that's quite good. Yeah. But I just thought for the money... Oh, it's not wanting to come off now. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, just a little bit of fun. Uh, we'll give it a quick measure. Helps if you try putting the lid back on the right way, Liz. Okay. Uh, Scotty Dog, for whatever reason, Scotty Dog tape measure has vanished. So I'm using my nice pink one. So we have got uh, 14 centimetres, which is about five and a half inches. So, yeah, not bad at all. This is the... Ooh, um, yeah, it's that one. Look. Ooh. <laughs> I must try and find my Scotty dog I can't be doing with losing my fingers <laughs> Only kidding, it's not that strong But uh, yeah, okay So that's my first little thing Thank you very much, Diamond Art Gift Right, let's have a look at this one This is a special drill project And where's the opening? Come on, where's the opening? Oh, it's on Oh, it is on that side I'm sure that they do this just to confuse me and as you know, I am easily confused. So a little bit of plastic there. We have our basic toolkit, pen, butt and wax. Enough to do your project. Oh, we've got an escapee there, look. 
Ooh, that's like a little pale blue one. So, ooh, lots of crystals, lots of sparkle. So let's see what we've got. We've got a sticker, and it's quite a big sticker, and it's a football sticker or a soccer sticker if you're in the uh, States, but I just thought that was really, really cute. And we've got the football there, we've got two penguins, and a very happy snowman with his earmuffs on and his scarf, and his little red jersey. Uh, yeah, and he's running around. So I just thought that one was quite sweet. Oh, <laughs> I'm not quite sure why that's there. But we've got a rubber duck. <laughs> this is the goalpost here. And we've got a rubber duck sat on top of the goalpost. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, not quite sure why there's a rubber duck on top of the goalpost. But we'll go with it. It's there. What can I say? Uh, yeah, okay. It, actually, that's quite a large rubber duck. Because if that's the size of the goalposts, I mean, goalposts are huge. So that duck's probably about 10 foot. <laughs> so it's not a little rubber duck. It's a huge rubber duck. Oh, my goodness me. Wow. Okay. Uh... <laughs> oh, well, at least they're enjoying it anyway. They're not um, phased by having a rubber duck on the goalpost. Maybe he's the goalie. Maybe as they kick the ball towards the goal, he's going to fly around at that size. I mean, he's just going to open his wings, isn't he? And he'd cover the whole goal. Yeah, good luck on scoring. <laughs> I just thought that was really cute. And again, you could either use it as a sticker, pop it on your wall or your window or wherever. Uh, but I'll probably make that into a Christmas card. Uh, it won't be this year now. All my Christmas cards uh, are on the way. Well, more or less. Um because, uh, yeah, uh, we've got postal strikes in the UK at the moment, so let's have a look at these specials. Oh, there's quite a few escape there, look. Some got stuck to the uh, package in there. Okay, have we got one of these packets open? Or are they just from another packet somewhere? Gently tip them. No, they've just escaped from another packet. They just decided they wanted to come and watch the football match. I'll see the rubber duck. <laughs> oh, let's give him a quick measure. Oh, dear. Oh, the trick tape measure. Right. So, width-wise, we'll go from the scarf there to the scarf there. So, we're about 12 centimetres at the widest point, which is about four and three-quarter inches. And then lengthwise, we are, oh, about 14 centimetres, which is roughly five and a half inches. So, ooh, ooh, ooh I've learnt now. Hang on to the end and it doesn't go. <laughs> okay, so what have we got? Oh, we've got a lovely Christmassy red and a lovely clear silver and Christmassy gold and a little bit of blue. And a nice palish green. Oh, and a very vibrant orange. I think that's going to be uh, penguins' feet and beaks. And a very dark Christmassy green. And just that little bit of black for the penguins. So, yeah, nice colours. Just a quick little easy project to do. Actually, I may even give it um, to uh, my nephew, my great nephew. Um, because he is into his diamond painting a little bit. He does like his football better. But he does like sitting and doing a little bit of craft. And I can't imagine it's very easy playing sn uh, football, snowball, football in the snow. So, yeah, that may be going his way. We'll have to see. Okay, so that's our first little project there to go with our little key pen. And let's have a look at this one. Looks like it's a Christmas and it looks like it's a special. I do think Christmas is just a time for special drill projects. Um, I've got uh, some big canvases, but I do like my specials. And Hubby actually said to me, I do like the sparkly ones. Have you noticed that some of your canvases don't sparkle as much as the others? So then I sat and started explaining to him about crystals and resin and acrylic drills. And he glazed over and started looking at TikTok. So that's the last time I talked to him about that. I'm a <laughs> 
Oh dear. All right, same toolkit again. Pen board and wax. Lots of nice special drills. Oh, some pretty colours in there. Oh, and some snowflakes. And it is. Yay, look. It's a Christmas bauble. Okay, we'll just flatten it out a little bit. Sorry, not bauble. Snow globe. It's three snow globes. And I thought this was really different and pretty because you've got your little one here with your teddy you've got your slightly bigger one here with your two snowmen and then you've got your very big one with your uh, Santa in and oh there's a straw there look why have we got a straw I'm not quite sure but we've got a straw standing there it's not a candy cane because it's like bent at the end oh no that's the reflection <laughs> it's not bent at the end it's reflecting Liz look at the picture properly uh, we've got a little globe there as well. I think that's a Christmas decoration. So, yeah, I just thought this was really a bit different and a bit pretty. And again, I am going to cut this one out once it's done. Um, it's not too bad for cutting out. We've just got a couple of little bumps there. And then this is the snow all around here. So none of this will be cut. So it's just a couple of little bits there, but it's mainly just those two leaves there that will be cut round. But it looks like we've got the little marquees to cover them. So, yeah, I'm going to cut this one out rather than having the white background because I think this is really pretty. But, yeah, just, it just spoke to me. I think sometimes when you, you're looking through on the website and you just think, I like that one. That is coming home to me. We've got eight different gems and colours. So, yeah. Well, we've got a candy cane down here, look. So that's definitely... Unless somebody had bitten the end off it. Somebody might have bitten the end off it because it's the same colours as the candy cane. <laughs> and then we've got some of those like peppermint sweets here as well. Uh, yeah. Oh, that's really pretty. I do like that. And everybody looks happy. Oh, no. Santa looks a bit worried, doesn't he? The snowmen look happy and Teddy's definitely happy. He's got his candy cane. Look, he's really happy. But uh, no, Santa does look a little bit worried there. I think he's looking at that list and thinking, oh my goodness me, how am I going to get all that down a chimney? Heck. <laughs> okay, let's have a look at these drills. Let me look, let me look. Which end does it open? It's, that's, there it is. Bought it. Oh, nice bright sparkly crystals. So we've got our lovely clear silver, Christmassy gold, Christmassy red, and Christmassy green. A little bit of pale blue there, possibly for the snowmen. And then we have some little green marquees. And then we've got those little rounds look with the like snowflake on them. Okay. And then some little marquees in uh, silver. And they've got an iridescent coating on. Very pretty. Oh, lovely. I like those. Okay. And let's pop those back in there. Oh, we'll give it a quick measure as well. It says it's 30 by 30, but I think it'll be about a 25 by a 25 foot. So I am going to cut it out and pop it on a mount board. So let me see. Whoa, we're doing inches first this time. So we're at nine and three quarter inches, which is 25 centimetres. And we'll just check it the other way. 25 centimetres, which will be the nine and three quarter inches. Ooh, oh, that's better, Liz. We've got a technique to it now. So that's that is lovely and yeah it's, there's not a lot on it um i mean there's enough to keep you sort of like busy uh maybe an hour or so just to uh, put those on again it doesn't matter whether it's uh it takes you ages or you do it as fast as you like um i'll probably have to do it quite fast because i want it on the wall for this christmas <laughs> okay and then finally we have This one isn't Christmas, I don't think. Oops, and this one is a 30 by 40. And, oh, it might be Christmas. 
Uh, this one's mm, about the same. I'm just going to say it's a little bit softer, but actually, no, I think it's about the same. Uh, they do need a good flatten because they have come a long way. Looks like they've just got a little bit of dust come with it as well, but never mind. And it is, oh, it is Christmas. Oh, and it is going to have to go on my wall. Oh, wow. Oh, I love that. Oh, we've got a fantastic Princess Castle look. And Santa's even delivering to the castle. Oh, wow. Well, we've got all the fireworks going off. It was the fireworks that drew me to this one. Uh, we've got all our Christmas trees here and our big Christmas tree with the star on top. But I love the little Santa. Look at him. With the little reindeer. Oh, he ain't got a red nose. My Rodolph is going to have a red nose. I will get a little red gem stuck on the end of there. Uh, yeah, he's got to have a red nose. Goodness me, Rodolph must have a red nose. And it's 11 different gems and colours. Looks like we've got a few different shapes. But wow, oh, that's gorgeous. All those fireworks. I was thinking it might be a bit more sort of New Year for New Year fireworks, but... Uh, looking at that that's definitely christmas because it's christmas eve wow you wouldn't have fireworks on christmas eve though right, would you because you'd wake all the kids up <laughs> and they get up early enough on christmas day you don't want them up at midnight as well on christmas <laughs> oh dear kids trundling down the stairs he's been he's been i don't care go back to bed it's three o'clock in the morning <laughs> No presents, no, go back to bed. <laughs> oh dear, what time do your kids get up on Christmas Day? Oh dear. Right. Okay, so let's have a look at these drills. Oh, that's really pretty. We've got stars, all the different colours on this castle. Definitely a princess castle. We've got a crown here. Look, it looks similar to a crown anyway. Down at the bottom. Same toolkit as well, pen, butt and wax. Oh, I can see a pack of little gold stars. Right, so, oh, and we've got a hot pink. Goodness me, yeah, we've just had two diamond painting projects with no hot pink in, so it's a good job this one's got hot pink. We can't have a list special unboxing without a hot pink. Okay, so then we've got a nice, ooh, that's a honey gold. A very bright sparkly silver, a little bit of like a turquoisey blue, nice Christmassy red, a champagne gold, a little bit of sea blue and a pale blue. That must be all the castle then. And some slightly larger rounds uh, that are faceted with uh, the pale blue and a very pale pink in slightly uh, larger rounds and then some little stars. Wow, do we, oh no, we need a couple of stars. I was going to say, do we only need the one star? But no, we do need a couple. There's a couple on the castle as well. So it looks as though the picture in this one is actually making up more most of the larger gems because some of those look a bit sort of uh, marquee type shapes, but actually they're just a round gem uh, in the middle of the colour. And it does work as well. Um, I have done others where you just put the round gem and because it's so sparkly, it does make it look as though it's a different shape. Very clever. But yeah, like that one as well. Oh, it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. <laughs> Uh, oh dear, I keep hearing that everywhere uh, I'm going at the moment. There are Christmas songs everywhere. And uh, yeah, I'm getting really in the mood, albeit we can't really go out in the snow at the moment. It's not a lot, but there is snow. And uh, yeah, Hilby's wheelchair doesn't work very well in snow. And I don't want him getting cold because obviously he's sat, so he's not getting warm moving around. Anyway, so huge thank you to uh, Diamond Dark Gift for sending me these. I absolutely love them. 
very Christmassy. We've got our lovely Christmas castle. I love that little Santa with his reindeer. This is the beauty of special drills. You can get all your bling and sparkle, but still get your picture as well. If this was a full drill, you wouldn't get the detail on the Santa and the reindeer. You'd just lose them. So you sort of get the, a little bit of the best of both worlds when you're doing these. Uh, we've got our little Santa stocking. Sorry, snowman stocking. I just, ugh, that duck is just going to crack me up. Let me know in the comments, why do you think there's a ginormous duck on top of the uh, goalpost? Is it maybe a, um, a mascot or something like that? I don't know. <laughs> and then finally, our lovely key to the door. Our lovely uh, diamond painting key pen. I think that's super as well. Okay, well, as I say, a huge thank you to diamondartgift.com. Do pop across and have a look on the website and have a look at all their special offers and everything that they've got. There's some really good ones at the moment. And if you've got any comments or questions, leave them in the comments down below. If you've enjoyed looking at these with me, as always, a big thumbs up is very much appreciated. And if you would like to join our little family and come back and see what I get up to next, then if you press that subscribe button down in this corner and the old notifications bell that pops up, you'll be notified when any of my videos come up so you won't miss anything. Yay! Okay, thanks ever so much for stopping by and I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.